Thank you for coming and checking out this video. My name is Andrew. I'm the senior content manager at TechRaptor.net, and with me today um, is, you know, creator developer of Binding of Isaac, Edmund Millen, here to talk to us about the unboxing of Isaac. This is a new physical product you guys have going on. So, um, Ed, let me know a little bit about what uh, what's going to be in these boxes. Well, yeah, we uh, Javon and I were trying to think of something that would be cool to do next physically. And the thing that always came up during every single Kickstarter was people wanted t-shirts, but it's not as easy as you think. And it's, you gotta really plan ahead <laughs> to like get everything ready and and, and actually appeal to um, a, a more wide audience. You know, I, there's a lot of different I, types of Isaac fans. Um, and we talked about doing t-shirts and t-shirts are always the thing I wanted to do. But it was like, how do we do it? And we always just like had a few T-shirts in each Kickstarter, and it was just like you could, you could get your size, and that's it. And um, with uh, <clears throat> when the when the when the new year came, it was like, well, let's do something, let's do something cool and interesting. And I and I have a, a, fr a friend of mine, Alex Pardy, who did a T-shirt box, and I thought it was really cool. Like it was really cool to not know what's gonna come next and then it's appears and it's this cool shirt and there's a bunch of little extras in the box and um i thought it was super neat and i was like can we do something like that and we actually had hooked up with his t-shirt um company and to, to fulfill the kickstarter the last kickstarter t-shirts and it was like well seems like we could just like <laughs> connect these dots here and do something really cool um, the two because yeah, it, it 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 was the most requested thing. Like everybody wanted more T-shirts, and there are so many knockoff T-shirts that are awful, awful <laughs> everywhere. And it's just like, oh my god! Like it, it it pains me deeply when somebody's like, I'm a huge fan, and 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 then they were like, look, and it's just like it looks like a child's drawing that they bought off of Redbubble, you know. And uh, so I wanted to do like really artsy, cool bold, iconic Isaac themed t-shirts um, for a year, um, one, once a month for a year. Um, and that's what we kind of set out to do. Um, each of the shirts are like drastically different. They're all from like either just amazing artists in the community or just amazing artists in general, even some classic artists from the eighties. Um, and uh, each box we were like, oh, what, how can we sweeten the deal? Because like Alex has got like stickers and stuff like that in there. And, <clears throat> we did, we're doing stickers, but we also wanted to incorporate four souls um, into it. So we're doing, originally we're like, we'll do one promo, <laughs> one promo card for each box. And then it's like, oh, uh, two, maybe three, three promo cards. And that's like three promo cards. And then we're going to do like monthly extra bonus promo cards for anybody who just buys anything off the site. So might as well throw that promo card into the box too, since it's a monthly thing. So it's like three to three, three, to four ish promo cards um per Three box. asterisk promo cards <laughs> yeah. per box um, <laughs> depends so how generous you're feeling that month <laughs> for sure well yeah or what kind of month it is you know if it's mother's day you know you got to do a mother's day card um so <laughs> the perfect gift for every yes. mother <laughs> yes it's perfect so yeah it's just this is this is going to be a fun new little adventure and um it, it's kind of fun to jump into um you know they're not they're not blind boxes for the most mm -hmm. part because you're going to get to see what the thing that's coming is but basically go into this blind box territory and be like what works and what doesn't work with people what do people don't what do people not like and like asking the community like what what are your pet peeves about this um and like i said i've signed up for a couple of different t-shirt um uh, monthly subscriptions and one of the ones that always stands out to me is that if there's a t-shirt that i know somebody else would have really loved like my 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 nephew or whatever else, um, and I'm an extra large and he is not, and I can't just give him the shirt and it work. So mm -hmm. that was one of the top things on my list of like, okay, well, I want to make it. Is how can we do this? Like, how can we do this so you can? It seems like you could just since we're doing a monthly subscription, you should be able to change on the fly, like with each month, and you can change your so you'll be able to see what you're getting, and then be like, oh my wife would love the shirt. I'm going to mm -hmm. change it to this size. Um, uh, or, you know, somebody else I know because, it, or if it's just not your style, like, oh, this shirt is, is too, too, too dark. Um, but I know the perfect person for it. And I've signed up for the subscription. I'm going to do that. Um, and then there's just the whole option of not signing up for this subscription and just getting the month to month and then just paying more. 
um, which is basically how it works. So yeah, the goal is a 12 once a month for one year. Uh, so there's 12 shirts, but if you sign up for all 12 shirts, there's a secret ultra exclusive 13th shirt. Ooh, that no, who knows what it is? I do, but <laughs> most most else don't. I think I'm the only one that knows because um, I'm making it. But um, and and you get a cheaper. I think it's like five bucks off each of the boxes mm -hmm. if you sign up that way. Uh, or we're just gonna do the monthly promo thing where it's like, hey, is a new fucking shirt? Sign up. It's you know five bucks more. All the extras are still there. Mm -hmm. Don't have access to the thirteenth legendary shirt, but can always like still get a whole bunch of other really cool stuff <laughs> <laughs> yeah it's still it's still total fanfare and it's um it's just a really fun little project that i think fans will like and it's again it's it's a, it's a it's about kind of like looking in to what people want and trying to fulfill it in the most logical and uh fun way mm -hmm. possible and working with some of these artists is very fun for me <laughs> uh, i really enjoyed it and you, you said that you, you sourced those artists from the community. Were they people that you'd seen work before? Were they maybe people who you had seen post yeah, up on Redbubble before and kind no, of <laughs> wanted so to get much. them in the loop? <laughs> you know, sadly, like a lot of the Redbubble shirts are not, uh, yeah, they're not exactly ones that I'd be like, oh, I want to contact that artist. But mm -hmm. um, it, a, a few, a handful of the artists were people that um, were part of the, the last Kickstarter that we did, we did a series of cards that were alternate art cards. Mm -hmm. And we had our artists from the community that that were pretty amazing, and uh, they did alternate art cards. So I contacted a few of my favorites of those, um, and then I contacted a few just iconic pop artists that I either had contacts with or worked with in the past. And then uh, I had a few recommendations from those artists that they're like, this person would be perfect. Um, so there's two there's two or three new people that I have not worked with that are really great. Um, I think one of the one of the shirts is one of the ones that we spoil but um but yeah there's just it's just a huge range a huge range and that's again another goal of like i really want to i want to i want to hit on each type of 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 isaac fan so we can make sure that like we've got a more school family friendly you know retro shirt and we've got death metal shirt and we've got you know, a very prideful, girly, colorful, feminine shirt. And we've got a, you know, a gender neutral, angelic light. You know, there's there's just such a range of shirts. And there's a lot there's a lot of uh, fanfare for different decades, too. There's like an, a very 80s shirt. There's a very 90s shirt. Um, there's even a bit of a 70s shirt, too. Um, and cool. 60s, so, I guess, in a way. So I get, uh, you know, to, for lack of a better term, is it kind of like the the boxes are attempting to be like themed almost without like as going far as saying a theme? Oh yeah, they're for sure themed. The um, all the cards. So I came up the the shirts were first, mm -hmm. um, and it's like how can we hit on all these different points and do all these different themes? Um, and then once those were established, then I designed four souls cards based on those themes. Sometimes oh. based on the month that they're released loosely at least halloween things got kind of moved around a little bit but there's some summary summary shirts and um some definitely octobery um fall shirts too that get a little darker but um yeah I, yeah I, I um the stickers and everything are all based around the boxes theme and i think they all have a pretty cohesive thing and for the for the cards and like the the card artwork has that also gone out to any i know that in the past four souls has been like collaborations with other indie games or other artists or anything is are should we be seeing any of those or are they going to be more of the the standard cards um they're going to be more their uniqueness is going to be tied to the t-shirt in question mm -hmm. um and there there are one or two little um guest artist type extras um which i guess you'll have to see when we get to them but mm -hmm. but yeah for the most part um they're just themed around um, the t-shirts. So I think the first shirt is the dogma shirt, um, which is the number one most requested shirt. And everybody's like, we want a dogma shirt. Um, <laughs> and it's fucking amazing. Um, Ori Ghost uh, uh, designed the the image for the shirt. I, sh I have the shirt. Can you, you want me to show you the shirt? I can sure. go grab if it. You wanna, if, yeah, if you want to go quickly grab a shirt, yeah. go for it. <laughs> okay, here's a shirt. All right. Ugh. 
Yeah, that's you can see that, right? That is fantastic. It's so good. <laughs> <laughs> um, it looks just phenomenal. And um, and it's a shirt that I would wear, which is nice. And uh, usually yeah. <laughs> when I talk about t-shirts, people are like, are they all going to be black? No, they're not. There's, there's nothing wrong with that. <laughs> there's, no, there's nothing wrong with as that. Someone, I, as someone with a wardrobe understand. filled with black pop art t-shirts. Yeah. That's awesome. I like that. <laughs> it's, a, it's, it's a fantastic shirt. There's a, there's, a, there's a few black shirts, but there's a few mm -hmm. colored shirts as well. Um, but yeah, the, the Dogma shirt uh, will come in the Dogma basically the first month of Dogma pack. Mm -hmm. And that will have three Dogma themed um, Four Souls cards and a, and a like a, a foily sticker. Um, we're still working on the size for that one, mm -hmm. <clears throat> but it's of the same, the same image. Is there always gonna be like the same type of cards? Like, will it always be a monster? Um, no. Some loot, I some treasure? <laughs> I based it off of the theme. So like okay. for for Dogma, Dogma version two, um, uh, Angelic Dogma uh, is, the, there's a monster. And then there's, I think there's a, a, a random happening um, called Static. Um, and then there's, oh man, there's a really cool one. It's, Christ, it's called Christian Broadcasts. Um, and it changes a bunch of stuff in the game. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, so they're they're all themed around the theme, <laughs> yeah. uh, but they're not necessarily like uh, like <laughs> there's some goofy ones, I and mean, you know there may or they're may neat. not be there may or may not be a series of meat cubes. <laughs> <laughs> are there any are there any cheeky cards that you know give your give the player a bonus effect if they're wearing the associated T-shirt? We didn't go all the way unglued <laughs> style with with the with this, but no <laughs> full no. meta. <laughs> not so not so much yet but there there are some there's some interesting ones like i said there'll be a mother's day there'll be a mother's day card which is mom's ring and you know maybe a father's day card is there going to be any new characters or are they specifically going to be um like their game cards or can you not say at the moment yeah, there may there's i mean we'll see we'll okay. see what happens <laughs> <laughs> um and you know of course one thing that i don't think that we've managed to happen upon yet you know when does when do when do the boxes start when do they end when can people expect to be able to uh take a look at i think is it the first two or three boxes that you guys are kind of you know letting people know about early i think we show three possibly four depending on what we're doing um i know that there's for sure three but we did have a website with four so i'm not 100 percent sure on that and jeremy if you can hear me <laughs> um if you can tell me i, I know i it's I, I is it the fifth of um april that we start yeah uh april 5th is when uh sign up start okay okay and sign up uh, start april 5th and then the first of the next month or is it the fifth uh, always the fifth of um, the months after the first of the next month got it okay so it'll be like the first of may you'll be able to see what will be in the june box so you can decide what what t-shirt sizing you want kind of thing well i think in in may you'll you'll see in may it'll start it'll show the may shirt and then then you can have that month to lock down your information and then okay. it'll do the is that is am i thinking about that right you you are so I, I, the, yeah. uh we're announcing the first three months so the first three designs mm -hmm. and then uh you have the entire month to order the next month's shirt or box and that will be shipped towards the end of the month to you Okay, so anyone who's interested, set a reminder for the first of the month, and everything will be there for you to to know what's going on. <laughs> or just fo much. follow me on Twitter, and I'll be. I mean, I'm going to be doing like a live stream, um, you know, the first of every month, essentially showing off what the next thing's going to be and talking about what's in the box, um, and uh, just talking about nonsense for an hour. Uh, and then I'll just be on Twitter constantly talking about it and showing off little bits and pieces as we go. Excellent. Um, well, uh, I want to say, you know, thank you so much for, for taking the time to sit with us and talk about this cool new, this cool new product. And you guys can all, uh, pay attention and keep it out. I think by the time that this video will be live, will also be when the pre-orders and everything begin. Um, Correct. so you can check the associated article in the description below, um, to get all the good links that you want. If you want to go and check out those first couple of, uh, t-shirt designs.
um otherwise you know thank you so much for uh for chatting with us it's been a blast thank you <laughs>